Over a year after he was indicted, one of Donald Trump's criminal trials has finally started, and he's making a stink over a family event it may cause him to miss. The highly anticipated Manhattan hush money trial against Donald Trump finally began on April 15, 2024. As predicted, it was drama-filled right from the start. The first day ended without any jurors being impaneled. More than half of those called were excused because they felt they couldn't be impartial, and only nine jurors were given the chance to answer unique questions, such as whether they support QAnon or the Proud Boys. The former president found himself back in court just a few weeks after the end of his civil fraud trial, which was also in New York, where he was ordered to pay a judgment of more than than $450 million. Just selecting the jurors in the criminal case could take as long as two weeks. After that, it could take a month or more for the attorneys to present their evidence and the final verdict to come in. That could potentially throw a wrench into an important Trump family occasion. Barron Trump is expected to graduate from Oxbridge Academy, his private high school in Florida, on May 17th. Trump's lawyers requested the court be adjourned that day so the former president could attend his son's ceremony, but Judge Juan Mershon didn't give a direct answer. The Daily Mail quoted him as saying, "...if everything is going according to schedule, then I'm sure we'll be able to adjourn, but if we're running behind schedule, we will not be able to." Trump interpreted Mershon's answer as a flat-out refusal, and he wasted no time slamming the decision to the press after court adjourned for the day. "...it looks like the judge will not let me go to the graduation of my son who's worked very, very hard." The former president went on to call his son a great student who was proud to be graduating and was looking forward to having his parents there for the event. He added that it looks like the judge isn't going to allow him to escape the trial for the day. "...it's a scam trial." Donald added that he believed the trial was a politically calculated move to thwart his presidential campaign. He said he wasn't just upset about potentially missing his son's graduation. He also noted that he won't be allowed to attend arguments in the U.S. Supreme Court over his claims of immunity in the case involving the January 6, 2021 riots at the Capitol or campaign events. "...that I'm not in Georgia or Florida or North Carolina campaigning like I should be. It's perfect for the radical left Democrats." If the former president does have to appear in court on May 17th, it wouldn't be the first disappointment for his youngest son. Barron was seemingly iced out by his family on social media on his 18th birthday on March 20th, with no apparent shoutouts online, though there's always the chance that was less a snub than a nod toward Barron's privacy. There's also always the chance Donald could be there for his son's university commencement. In fact, according to the hosts of the PBD podcast who have spoken to Barron, the soon-to-be grad may change his choice of college depending on whether his dad moves back into the White house.